Praise God, praise God. This is Prophetess Deanna Dixon. Alrighty then, God bless you, God bless you. I have another video that God was talking to me about, so I definitely want to um, I want to keep it going. Okay, so let me tell y'all this. And if you look at the title, it says, they keep throwing dirt. <laughs> oh, come on somebody, I'm trying to encourage you tonight. Come on somebody, hallelujah, I'm telling you what God say. So, <laughs> I got, I got so much to say. God said that people that hate you, God will let your own hate destroy you. I'm going to say that again. Stop hating people. God said he will let your own hate destroy you. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. So when the enemy throws dirt on you, this is what you got to start saying. Oh, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. You know how people like to throw dirt on you? Talk about your past, lie, all this other stuff. Come on, somebody. Stop getting mad. Stop getting doing this. Stop doing that. No, you got to think differently. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Remember, we got to renew our minds. That's why I love Joshua 1, 8 and 9. One, actually, 1, 5 through 9. Because it says, have I not commanded you? Be strong and of good courage. Come on, somebody. I will be with you. He said, meditate on this law day and night, and then thou shalt make thy way prosperous. So when you say make, that means it's going to be opposition. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. So let me get in and tell you what God was saying. When the enemy throws dirt on you, this is how you got to start, t start telling them. That's my element. I came from the mud. <laughs> I'm about to preach this thing. Let me tell y'all something. You have to be resilient. So let me tell you what the acronym DIRT stands for that God gave me. The DIRT is I'm diverse. The D in DIRT, I'm diverse. You coming at me this way, I'm going to go out that way. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. God going to always teach me how to respond, how to act, what to say, and what to do. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. The I in DIRT means insurmountable insurmountable strength god will bless you where you are strong in the lord that no matter what the enemy throws at you that you're gonna be strong you're gonna be able to last you're built for this come on somebody i'm encouraging tonight the aura is god will give you a resistance in your spirit that no matter what they do it won't break you it won't stop you it won't block you it won't hinder you come on somebody stop focusing on people and focus on your purpose come on somebody hallelujah and the T is God will terminate anything or anybody that tries to stop you. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Y'all don't hear what I just said. So I want to encourage you tonight. I don't care how people throw dirt on you. Say, get, honey, I was made for this. You talking about throwing dirt on me. I came from the mud. I came from the dirt. Huh? Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. And, and, and you thought. The thought to bury me. Come on, somebody. But I grew in that dirt because it was sorrow. Come on, somebody. That dirt, you don't understand. All that stuff that people say and do, it builds your character. It builds your tenacity. It builds your anointing. It builds you. Hallelujah. You broke through it. Don't you know in dirt, that's where you grow? Don't you know in dirt, that's where you survive? Don't you know in dirt, that's where you thrive? Oh, come on, somebody. Quit tripping. Let them talk. Hallelujah. Oh, come on, somebody. As a matter of fact, let's go here. John 8, 6, 8. It says, the teachers of the law and the Pharisees were using this question as a trap in order to have a basis for accusing Jesus. Hmm. Sound like, sound like um, we've been there before, huh? Always trying to accuse somebody. Let's continue. But Jesus bit down and started to write in the ground with his finger. Or may I say the dirt. When they kept questioning him, he straightened up and said to them, If any one of you is without sin, let him be the first one to throw a stone at her. Again, he stooped down and he wrote again. So he, he went back to the dirt. You know why he went back to the dirt? Because he knew that was coming with some dirt. Oh, come on, somebody. When people come with dirt, you got to understand that that same dirt, that's what grows. Plants. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Don't you know that God has you planted? Oh, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. That you were a seed. Oh, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Grow in the dirt. Grow through the dirt. Use the dirt. Oh, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. God going to help you through the dirt. You're going to win through the dirt. You're going to prosper through the dirt. Hallelujah. Y'all get the drift, huh? So stop worrying about the dirt, God says. Because in the mud. Oh, I'm about to go ahead and preach this thing. From dirt you came, and from dirt you going to return. Didn't he make man from dirt? Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. So that's your elements. So every time they throw dirt on you, say, that's all you got. Because I was I came from the mud. What you talking about? Hmm? <laughs> Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. I feel happy up in here. Hallelujah. 
Now, I just want to get in and get on. Because let me tell you something. People will try to, they'll try to remove your crown, especially if you're a woman. Uh, oh, come on, somebody. Kings, too. Men, too. But I need to tell y'all something. Stop just stooping down to their level. Because royalty walks a certain way. Hmm. Royalty talks a certain way. We don't chase and we don't run because we don't want our crown to fall off. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. You see, Queen Vashta, there's a difference between Queen Vashta and Queen Esther. Queen Vashta had a, a mouth on her. Mm -hmm. That's why he got rid of her. You understand? People that, that talk and gossip and do all that stuff. Y'all don't hear what I'm saying. And, and then God chose Queen Esther. Hallelujah. It's a way you're supposed to carry your crown. <laughs> it's the way you're supposed to walk and talk. Stop letting people get to you, God says. God says, continue to be strong in the power of his might. Know who you are in Christ. There it is. There it is. There it is. Because everything that they throw on you was built, was built to come against it. Let me tell you something. God has you right where you're supposed to be. It is not over. You will not lose. Don't give up, God says. God says, keep your eyes on the prize. For I have ordained you. I have sustained you. I have called you. It doesn't matter who follow, who don't. It doesn't matter what they say, what they do. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> oh, my God. Let me tell you something. God is doing something in this last hour. Don't miss it. Don't let anyone make you miss God. Because of gossip, lies, them throwing dirt on you. Because I see what's happening in this last hour. And I'm going to say this. People are getting offended. And God don't want you offended. Because let me tell you something. I don't like foolishness. Because foolishness throws you off. It throws you off. So you have to dismiss that thing real quick, God says. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So I just wanted to get up on here a quick encouragement. And somebody write that. You talking about throwing dirt on me? I come from the mud. I was built. This is my element. Somebody write. That's my element. Y'all keep throwing dirt. That's exactly what I need to grow. Thank you. Thank you. Hallelujah. God says, I'm going to end it with this. God says, I'll bless you in the presence of your enemies. Y'all sitting up there crying about them. No. If you're really cool with it, pull up a chair. <laughs> yeah, I said it. I said it. I said it. Oh, Lord have mercy. Let me get up off of here. God is good. I say God is good. I just want to do quick encouragement. Just quick encouragement because that's what we need. Y'all know what time it is. Roll our soldiers for that is truly who we are. Walk like it, talk like it, act like it, be like it in Jesus Christ of Nazareth's name. Amen and amen. God bless.